just saw him a second ago, and this morning a special walk the dog adventure. A wayward border collie missing for months is now back with his rifle owner in Orland, thanks to the Chico community rallying behind the dog named Buddy. And for our purposes, AKA Court Clopping. My name is Buddy, and boy, do I have an adventure to tell you. Problem is, I'm a dog, so I can't talk. That means I'm the only one who knows all the details of what transpired over the last five months. I'll let my humans tell you what they think happened. I fostered him for Gail. Okay. She's the original owner. Are you ready to see Gail? I think Gail should tell that story. It was a tough decision that I had to make to surrender him to the shelter. I just didn't have a choice at that point. I was just too ill from cancer treatment. But he's quite an escape oh artist. And two days later, he decided to go on this big adventure. People ended up calling him Houdini because he was seen. People turned around and he was gone. I think he was trying to get back to me. I really think he was looking for a way home. So we believe that uh, he traveled the bike path. He ended over by Eaton Road, and then he traveled all the way to the cemetery over by the Chico State Farm. So that's the other side of town. Bloody safe. So many times he could have gotten hit. To survive this long, it was only the effort from people feeding him and following him, making a map. Thinking about all the time he spent running around Chico and wondering what he felt like, what he thought, what he went through. I wish I, I wish he could talk. I really do. One thing is for certain. Now I have two families that love me. What more could a guy ask for? What I want for him is that he's happy. I am just so happy to have him back and he's not leaving again, I'll tell you that. This is going to be right by my side every second. And Gail and Anya, probably Buddy too, say they are grateful to everyone who helped log Buddy's movements and to those who finally nabbed him. And since his capture, he has been fixed and had a full medical checkup, all expenses paid thanks to public donations.